is a new boy, and apparently his attitude is wrong. If Bill can take this, he can stay. If not, then it's back to the streets. Now, you should know better, OK? Now, start talking to your peers a bit more. And that's your last warning. OK. Thank you. Everyone go then. It seems to me like I'm in jail, you know? It's like I can't go nowhere. I've got to have someone following me everywhere. I can't go to the toilet if no one, you know, if someone to follow you to the toilet. Yeah, where did you come from? Mary is down at Penrith. Yeah. You ever go up the cross much? Oops. I've yeah. seen you up there a lot. His name's Brad, another addict made good, and he's the boss, all 21 years of him. And so to Bill, he's Mr. Hunter. If you want to give me a hand, I'll just have to move a desk. Just leave this for a little while, OK? And um, then we'll come back and finish it off, all right? I just want to use him this desk. Sure. Such graces on top of sweeping the carpets don't come easy for a streetwise junkie. Like just young kids, you know, like 15, 16 year old, they've been here a bit longer than me. And they're like a level one or something like that. And they've got to give, they give you orders and you've got to follow them orders. And if you don't do what they're told, they sort of like bore you out. They, they, they call those groups on you and they get you in the middle and all shout at you and stuff like that. Like it hasn't happened to me yet, but if it happened to me, I'd spin out. I'd probably walk out the gate, you know. And with six days to court, Bill does pack his bag to walk out. If you're not surprised, Neither is anyone else. What do you want to go for? I just got a split. Where are you going, Bill? What are you going back to? Well, I've got troubles at home to sort out. How are you going to sort your troubles out at home? You can't even sort yourself out. You and it's another to dose to of that who's medicine. With friends like these, you might say, who needs heroin? What have you got to show for 29 years of living? One bag. What have you been using for 10 years or something? Where's it got you? Facing jail sentence, mate. You leave here, you're going to be back in jail, and that's a cop out. You know it. This is the only place you'll get your life back together. The you understand, place. mate? The fact it's is, good. most starters here do try to leave. Not all of them come back like come Bill. On, come back inside. But if he stays here, you know, he's got a chance. But if he goes back out and keeps on using, well, he's, he's down the drain. I think, you know, if Bill keeps up with the attitude that he's got at the moment, you know, I reckon he'll have a good go at it, you know? But I, I wouldn't, you know, they're like horses, drug addicts. I wouldn't put money on them, you know? whose motto is stay off heroin for one day at a time. And even with that pretty heavy-handed sort of treatment, one day at a time is about all Bill could manage at the moment. It really is psychology at its crudest. Tear a person down and build a new one. And what you're going to go back to? Because you always go back to something worse. You know? it never changes. You're always going to use again. If you, if you want to leave the program, you're going to use again. Day and night group sessions like this are a who specialty. Discussion, confrontation, and hopefully, confession. Admitting it's one thing, accepting it's another thing. Bill, what's the worst is, um, thing you've ever done to your family? Oh, ripping them off for money. What's the largest amount of money you've ever borrowed off them? Oh, it's about $1,000. Did you pay it back? No, I scored dope with it. It's now 11 days and Bill's still here. He surprised himself and a lot of other people. No, really but Bill says for the first time in 12 years, he's getting off on life well, you know, and not on drugs. Him, they're going to tell my sisters. See, half the battle with someone is that they've got to want to do it and Bill wants to do it. So once that initial want is taken, you know, the transformation happens pretty quick. Uh, when I first come in here, I thought, you know, I'm never going to change. I'm going to be, I'm going to be a junkie all my life. What's changed your mind? Just that I'm starting to think a lot clearer now. And I like all the people here now, and they're trying to help me. If you think that Bill's transformation here is just too good to be true, one of those miracles you only see on those before and after diet commercials, then so did we. But the experts say, spectacular, yes, remarkable, not really. Uh, I think Bill's very scared to go in the court. Uh, I think Bill's very scared to go in the jail. And, uh... It's, I, you know, I think everyone here feels for Bill, but, uh, you know, it's something that he did. You know, we, we hope and pray that he'll get bonded to the program or something will happen like that, but, you know, it's in a power greater than ourselves' hands, you know, at the moment. Third one. 
Bill Carruthers and the CI Group to level one. At whose good behaviour is rewarded with promotion, Bill, it seems, is a star beginner. For a moment, it's as though the battle's won. But far from it. The hugs and kisses are simply a reward for not running away. Bill, or for that matter, any of the people here, could clear out tomorrow. Others have, and then it's back to the streets and the heroine. As we've said, the taste always lingers. Once a junkie, always a junkie. Yeah. The worst time is at night when you're left with just yourself. They're like horses, drug addicts. I wouldn't put money on them. Yeah. When will you stop thinking about hitting up and wanting to hit up? Have you any idea? I'd say in about six or seven months' time. You think it'll take as long as that? Yeah. What if someone came up to you now and handed you a foil? I'd have second thoughts about it. Day 14, the day of reckoning. Remember, Bill's original reason for kicking the habit was the hope of a lighter sentence. That's what started him off. How he'll finish, no one really knows. At the end of the 14 days, Bill Carruthers went before a judge to hear his sentence. But rather than a decision, the matter was carried over to further hearings for the court to gather more facts. His 14 days has become a longer ordeal than he ever could have imagined.